Yeah, I, uh... I don't even remember the brand. Um, but yeah, I got this this water bottle um, on the recommendation of Grand Pooh Bear, and I've been real happy with it. It's not the final boss. I mean, if you have... If you have information that I don't, um... I'd love to hear it. That's, that's definitely the boss that triggers credits. Currently, this is only on Steam. There is a demo on itch.io. Um, and it's coming out to consoles sometime this year. Jeez, what a terrible start. Thank you very much for the good luck. All right. First rat should level me. Silver Star 82, yeah. There's, uh... There's some serious uh, inflation that goes on in this particular economy.
Why would I pick that up? It's a room cycle, so I don't know how I lost time there. Whatever. There we go. Which should put me on a good track for leveling up. Mostly good luck. Yo, anime boy, thank you very much for the good luck. How's your learning going? Yeah, the way that this game is paced is pretty interesting. Okay, yeah. That puts me on a good good spot for leveling up. Alright, well, this is not gonna be the best split ever. I've never missed that thing before. Go slow, then. Yeah, yeah, the, um... The fights are a lot harder when you're underleveled. Welcome back, Media. Yeah, this game is really, really good about movement. Oof. Oof. That's real bad. 
is also bad. Yeesh. I'm just taking shots to the to the face today. Not not the best way to play video games, if I'm being honest. Wrong screen. Now we turn around. Yeah, 100% run is going to be really neat. I know Rogue Link is working on routing it. Or Rogue Link or Melos, I forget which one. Uh, one of the two other people who's really interested in this game is working on 100%. Uh, the big problem with Hundo is that... It routes... Oh, no, that's real good. It routes um, individual chests that you've opened as part of the percentage. I'm the worst at this. It's fine. I'm bad at video games. I've been trying to use the forward one of those two, and it's a lot harder to get it in a good position. Please? Thank you. This is such a warm-up run. You know, these mice do enough damage that I've been considering the viability of a death warp here. I don't think it's probably worth a lot of time, but I think it's probably faster. Basically, just don't pick up a herb until, um... until your way back. The big problem with it is um, it would mess with my level routing. And experience routing is already really tight in this spot specifically in this game.
Yeah, you'd give up the gold from one of them. this way. Right, I now may not get hit. Really, really, really need to level up here. No, I'm not going to fight that guy from above. We're all good. Yeah, that was a fun damage boost to find. supposed to take that hit. That jump, you literally just hold left, and it's the scariest jump in the world because you never feel like you're actually going to make it. Good. 
off to fight Mewtwo. Good luck, Arya. This run's gonna come to an abrupt end very soon. I mean, it is earlier than normal, but obviously it's not too early. if you blame me. Nope. I wasn't planning on doing the death warp after leveling up. I was planning on leveling up right before going to the boss. I just, I, I timed it out uh, poorly. I would love to take credit for that bit of foresight, but... But no, I did not see that far ahead.
Yep, that is correct. I don't do that backtracking in the speedrun, though. It's not worth the time. I'm too poor anyway. I want to hit reset, but I'm not gonna. Not yet. Honestly, it wouldn't have mattered if I got it. Yo, Nooster, how's it going? I can't. I can't buy a herb, so... This will be real fun. Thank you for the good luck. If I'm honest, I don't think this is going to be the run, but...
I have a lot of questions about the fact that that golden. Spawn one of the lava bubbles there. Neat. God, I'm the worst at this video game. Yeah, this game's really challenging in a way that I find to be very engaging. That's definitely true. Hmm. Okay. Neat. What's the next room that I have to- oh, yeah, this one. Neat. Take my death warp. Too bad. No, it's a good room. I really enjoy doing it. And it feels real good when you do it well, but... I was planning on death warping. Not there, though. Somehow not. Neat. Oh, I also don't have the ring yet. Let's forget about this room.
I think it's something like 10% of your XP. I'm actually not 100% certain. But 10% feels right. That seems to be what it normally is. Maybe there's a modifier depending on what your current level is. So mad.
Oh, death count mattering would be interesting. is another just really fantastic game. You definitely didn't make a mistake purchasing Ori. I think this game is also very, very fun, but if you were choosing between two incredibly well-done games... sword. I didn't want that level up there. All right, Austin Thafford, I hope that you have a wonderful evening.
I was just, out of force of habit, I was going to, um, I was going to go purchase a uh, herb, even though I'm planning on death warping here. I don't remember whether or not you had herbs. You don't. You have a heart. percentage for each death is definitely increasing. It's unclear if it's death counter level. Interesting. Neuster, thank you for doing science. I really appreciate it. Well, at this point, we're sort of on world record pace. Kind of sad because it's been a real bad run so far. Here. Dummy. No. 
was not the quickest way to do that. No. Wait, no, I'm going to four. Shoot. Did three. Four is this. That was not smart. No, the dragon sword uh, is the first sword in the game that hits enemies uh, two times. Oof. Well, if I wasn't going to death warp before, I certainly am now. When you pick up the flea scroll, that's when you're able to start doing the upswing. Yeah, well, the dragon armor has good defense and it uh, protects you against very hot temperatures. It's kind of a throwback to Wonder Boy 3. Two things that I care about. The first is this... Second is getting elixir. I guess elixir means that I can't do the death warp. Just realized I had enough money to begin with to buy the lightning sword. It was real silly of me not to already have done it. Oh well. Elixir uh, fills up your health to full. Uh, big potion fills ten hearts. Ten hearts is one row of hearts. Uh, 
How am I making these good splits? Routing. Certainly not by being good. I've got two unintentional deaths in this run already. Two? Three? I forget how many. I've got a lot of unintentional deaths in this game, in this run already. Wait, no. I can just drop out from here, can't I? Nope, sure can't. Real happy about my health sitch now. No, not Monkey Parasite. Adventure Buddy. Yeah, that wave effect only happens when I'm not at low health, which is a, a minor, minor issue right now. About to fix it, though. Much better. He's a friend. Even my split says adventure buddy. Rude. Always the time to get stealing. Please go down. Shout outs to Wonder Boy Three. So much going on that's rude right now.
Okay, good to know. That one's not worth. There's no death warp there. By the by, um, it might not be immediately obvious, um, but for people who are planning on running this game, note that I'm doing that upward slash on the latest frame that I possibly can as I'm leaving shops. It spawns me offset by like 20 pixels when I do that. Ooh, good start. Fine. This is fine. That's my third unintentional death. I'm so upset right now. This game has got me tilted. game. Whatever. 
It's fine. Didn't die. Nice. So time for the fetch quest. It's true, she gave me her heart. Oops. And as such... It would be wrong of me. Downright criminal. Thank you. 
Uh, that fight can be pretty hard. Yeah, I now have the Blessed Sword and Armor, which um, helps. It's embarrassing. Starting to get a feel for what the right routing is here. And this was not it. I can now do this. It's already open. this way.
fine. There's a herb in here. You know what? Let's just avoid damage. Okay, cool. I think that that makes me good to go.
No, I, I just started doing Goldevious there because it's one less warp. Drinking the vile water um, restores three hearts. Cool. All right, less cool. planning on buying another one, so it doesn't matter. Star Scream. Thank you very much for the host. Welcome everyone. I'm real bad at this game.
Yeah, run's going okay so far. Going. I'm going to blue. Like that. That is how you beat it.
Act Awesome. Thank you very much for the host. Never want to PB by too much. PB is still possible. I'm not sure if World Record is possible anymore. I do not currently hold world record. Uh, Melo Soro in chat took it from me um, last night. World record. Not my goal time right now, but world record. Neat. Uh, Sagging Rufus. Yes, this is on the PC. It's going to be coming out on a bunch of consoles soon as well. Thank you for the GGs and the congrats. We'll be doing more tonight. This was such a bad run, just overall. Hey, Father Wolf, thank you for the congrats. It's true, world record doesn't bring back uh, Soldier Dude. Yeah, four unintentional deaths. Really not a good run. I'm going to let the credits play out while I run AFK real quick, and then uh, we'll get another run going after this. Hopefully, uh, this is not going to be the new world record VOD. It'll just be some random PB upload on YouTube. We'll see.
Okay, I'm back. I have more water, so Stay Hydrated Bot doesn't yell at me. Does Valian really go, I'm gonna be a god, though? Like, that's one thing that kind of, uh, maybe I, I just didn't read into it the right amount, but it seemed like Valium was just evil for evil's sake. Okay, Avana, I like that uh, interpretation a lot better than mine. I'm pretty sure that it's just supposed to show that they've uh, erected a statue in every one of the villages. Uh, but I like the idea of a traveling, like not even a traveling, but a stolen statue. I like that one more. Like uh, every village just has a trickster that goes out and, and steals a statue at night. And that's how it gets moved around. Yo, made four months in a row. Thank you so much. That is immensely generous of you and very, very appreciated. Just a heads up, since there are a few names that I don't recognize in chat, um, all of the money from this stream through cheers, through subscriptions, uh, really everything, gets passed along to the Extra Life uh, charity drive that's linked in my uh, my stream info. So when... Uh, when people subscribe. Yo, Royal Blue Wizard with the tier 1 gift sub to Avon Chaos. Thank you as well. So people like that, people who are subscribing and supporting the channel, they're making me feel real good about doing this, but more importantly, they're helping out sick kids, and that's really, really freaking cool. Uh, Sagging Rufus. Yeah, I, I was on the couch for the Final Fantasy VI run. It was, uh, it was a real blast to be on uh, to be on a run commentating for Puexel and alongside Vulichin and Takaze, who are just both giants in their own right. Yeah, I was stealth uh, for the first half of the run. Um, the, the camera was a bit lower so that it could shoot the audience. Uh, and as a result, I was like, I think you can see my arm, because I was leaning on the couch. Uh, I think you can see my arm to the side of Boexel. Couldn't have been more perfect if they tried. But then after the opera, uh, they adjusted the camera. There's a mouse on stream. Oh no. Melis, I'm planning on submitting this for AGDQ, yeah. No, it didn't bother me. Um, I was there to support Boexel. That was not my show. Oh, that makes sense. Multiplies your, your current XP by 0.15, then rounds for XP loss. Uh, this game came out uh, June 19th this year. So just under a month old. A bunch of us did a blind race of it uh, this past Sunday. So really the game's been speed run for five days now. So it's been fun what we've been able to accomplish in that five days. Well, Rufus, I'm about to do another run right now. Hopefully the next one is world record as well. 